What are you doing, you dirty dog? You had water this morning in a bowl, fresh, clean water. Did you know? There we are. Good girl. Headed off on a quick little one or two overnighter up into the mountains. Beautiful area. Off we go. Uh, forecast is maybe for some rain, but I think that's that's always the forecast this time of year. So we're just gonna go and and hope for the best. And it hasn't been raining all that much. Even when it does rain, it's only for part of the day. And uh, up in the mountains, you, you never know. So uh, even if the forecast is for clear and sunny, it could rain. <laughs> so we're gonna go and try and have some fun. I think we will, eh, Mira? Yeah. Bike's loaded up, got some food, and there's possibility of buying food at some uh, little restaurants along the way too, so we'll probably do that. Hey, Mira, you ready? Come here, come in. Yeah, that's a good girl. Volkswagen Beetle, still the sound of Mexico. Day. Not sure if uh, sealant's drawing out of my tires or what the deal is. Um, I got, it seems like I have a slow leak. I pumped up the tire a bit this morning and uh, I was feeling squishy on this climb and sure enough, <laughs> very low. So I've put some air in it. We'll see how it goes. And, uh, but I do have some concentrated tire sealant with me. so. Put a little bit of that in if uh, I need to. And then uh, tire, I think looks pretty good, but we'll see how it is at La Masita. So I gotta stop and pay entrance fee there. And then, uh, yeah, continue on. It's uh, sunny at the moment and very humid. I'm just drenched in sweat. So not what I mean. Not my favorite. But anyway, we'll take our time and enjoy the day. It's incredible how fast things are growing in this climate. I was here a week ago, I guess, with Mira, just on a morning ride, and uh, they were just planting corn, and now it's already poking its ears up. And another little plot, they're probably 
I guess, knee height now, or a bit more. Depends how tall you are. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's wonderful to see all this lushness. Hasn't been a ton of rain this year in the rainy season, I guess, according to what locals say, but it's, uh, it's enough to, at least things are starting to grow. But I guess the concern is obviously later on in the year when it's the dry part and there's not enough water in the ground coming out of the mountains. And that's when the concern is, but for now, it, to my uneducated eyes, looks pretty good. So does the valley below. Amazing. Buenos Hola. Hola. Buenos días. ¿Qué tal? Hi. Hi. Crazy cats, you okay?
Okay, good eat, Jeff. Logging going on there, Mira. Chilly now. Have some lunch. This shirt is, is entirely synthetic and um, I'm chilled now. I mean, it's, we're pretty high. We're, I've, I've gained about a thousand meters from uh, this morning, but um, yeah, I'm freezing. So I'm going to change. <laughs> and I'll throw you some sticks, okay? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh. Soggy, soggy. We're out for a little walk here just to try and get warmed up. I mean, it was raining hard enough. It was hard to get all my clothes out to uh, trap the heat in without getting them all wet. So decided to leave them in the bags. Just went for a little walk down the trail here. Yeah, a little movement warm me up. And uh, yeah, the water just pooling in these trails. It was running pretty good there for a while down there, as you can imagine. It's going. That's the challenge with the alcohol stove is getting the right fuel. This one is 70% uh, denatured alcohol. And um, at these higher altitudes, I'm not sure how, it, how well it lights. Um, certainly in colder temperatures, it wouldn't do so well. And then, um, yeah. It's definitely going. Yeah. And they're super quiet, which is kind of nice. That's the, the big plus about it. We'll see how that goes. One of the other things I'm experimenting with 
is instant coffees. So here, Cafe de Oya. Oya is a kind of a, a pot, often a clay pot. Um, and so the coffee traditionally, I think, has uh, sugar and cinnamon in it. I'm not sure if this has any sugar in it. I haven't looked, but it does have cinnamon. I chased it a little bit. It's a, it's not bad. It's a, I mean, it's a funny thing. Um, yeah, it does definitely has sugar in here. Um, and then I guess to do uh, trying out the SNES Cafe, and they're they're cheap. It's like you know, it's like uh, 10, 11 pesos, and I can get uh, one or two. Well, get uh, sorry, two or three cups out of this. Um, it says seven, but that's <laughs> that's too much. Uh, I, maybe I can get four if I'm really frugal. I could get four, but I won't get seven. Um, and then I'll use. I'm trying out the the coffee mate. It says six cups here. So so that theoretically could almost do me a week um, if I drank a, a coffee a day. So that's pretty cheap, and and look how compact it is. And then um, I got some chocolate milk to uh, 90 and 90 years um, with with us with you contigo. So um, yeah. Anyway, I, I'm trying that these out for some different flavors and um, instant coffee is certainly way easier than um, than brewing with beans. It's hard to get good beans sometimes, and just the, the volume of it. Adds up. Feel better. Got out of that wet shirt. I uh, just have it. Oh, come on! Put your foot down. You got a little. She does this, don't you? Come here. Come here. Come here. Yeah. See, it's fine. You think there was something there, but there's not. Is there? Nope. A cat attacked you this morning. You didn't think much of it. Ah. <laughs> With all the uh, pines that are up here in this part of the forest, you come off the trail at all, and it's just so soft walking around. Definitely gonna look for a place that I can pitch the tent. Like this, I won't even need an air mattress. Looks like a bit of a hobo camp here, doesn't it, Mira? Hopefully that new tent shows up soon. Can you carry the stick? Let's go for a little walk. Enjoy this lovely forest. Oh my goodness. So nice. The guy's harvesting wood here. Cutting boards, it seems, already. Burning up slash piles. I wonder how it works here. Still standing. Look at that thing. North of the border, that thing would be chopped down for sure. There's another one over there. Oh, like, yeah, right up in there. Another one over there. Just some, some big old trees that keep everything. Big old pines and then you got oaks and mosses and flowers everywhere. Ah, amazing. Mm. Oh, that sun feels good, doesn't it? Hmm, rained a lot last night. Time for coffee. Yeah. Mm hmm. Hi. Hello. Hello. How are you?
Definitely the best travel water dish out there. And I forgot your food bowl in the casita, Mira. So we're just gonna set it on top of... Ah, I made a mess here, haven't I? I'll put your food on top of this dry bag. One more stick through. Almost ready. Nice. Okay. Oh no. Y dos. Hey, mira. Well, while Mira goes and looks for her, her stick, I'm gonna make some coffee and enjoy the morning. Off in the distance, I can hear a chainsaw going, and but if it, somehow it's just it's not it's not bothersome. It's people just doing work, and then. Uh, can hear some of the insects and the birds. Yeah, it's beautiful up here. It really is. All right, sweetheart. I don't think we've left anything behind. Yeah. <laughs> Someone's excited. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mira, come up, hey, up there. Yes. Okay, stop chirping.
izquierda. like one of the bromeliads, the air plants fell off. Let's see if I can get you back in the tree. Uh, nope. <laughs> All right. Let's go, little maniac. <sighs> Need to get the front brakes worked on. Little brake lead, maybe? Yeah. New fluid. Drop down. No. <laughs> sure. Hey, leave the squirrel alone, man. Squish you. Let's go. You gotta run forward. I'll go faster. I'll try it. <laughs> Sure is opening up as we get lower here. <clears throat> I guess easier to log here or elevation temperature for the trees. Who knows? Hey, Mira. Hey, Mira. Mira. Wait. Behind. Good girl. Good behind. OK, 
Here we go. Good girl. Good girl, yes. Yeah. Yeah, if you like and subscribe, more support for this little girl. Those artisanal organic throwing sticks don't come easy. Takes a lot of miles to find those. <laughs>